Welcome to the Merry Boozers channel again. Continuing Toss and Boss week, we have the Little Lippish from Freewing. Um, I've had a ball with this airplane, flown it a ton. Um, it's a little hard to see this one, guys, so if your vision's not the best, this might not be the best one for you. Um, I've, I've loved the little guy. You can see it's been landed out here on our Geotex a lot. It's a sturdy airplane, too, because it has been nosedived into the ground once and repaired. Uh, I don't think you can tell right now. It was it was pretty bad crash, but hey, you know, that's part of it. I just dumb-thumbed it, and it went in the dirt. <laughs> but uh, I've had a ball with this little one, guys, and for the, I think this one's $109. It's a wonderful airplane, and we plan on showing you here momentarily, so let's get it out to the field and get it tossed and bossed. All right, guys, here we go. It's time to toss and boss. Ready? Whee! Right <laughs> I'm going to fly slow for you, Lori, so you can kind of get used to it. This one's hard to film, guys. But it can slow down. One thing I like about the Lippish is I'm going to just show you here how gentle it can fly. I meant to turn the timer off too, where it wouldn't be talking the whole time. I'm sorry about that, guys. But look at how gentle this thing is. Timer start. All right. So you've seen how slow it can fly. Laurie, are you ready? Do it. Oh, I did it. <laughs> Here it comes again. I'm gonna fly about half throttle for you right now. No gyro in this plane, of course. Turn it right out here in front of us. Timer stop. Timer stop. Whee. Timer start. Nothing like the little stall there. Four Let minutes. it flop on Time itself. Three minutes. Timer stop. <laughs> Too much fun. And the roll rate is ballistic. I actually have it lower. I'm going to go into the full rate aileron, or aileron throw. Here we go. You know, it's a fun one too. If you have the 1500 battery in it like I do, you can take this thing, go up, and put the sticks together and look at it. Just flop over itself. Did you get that by any chance, Lori? Yeah, I did. Okay. I'm going to do it again. If y'all didn't get to see that move, it's one of my favorite ones. You put your stick in the top right corner or top left corner, and it will just go nuts. Three minutes. Woo! It's a four cell. It's it is a ball of a little airplane, though. Timer start. Let's do the crazy move one more time. See how good that camera girl is. I'm going to go down past so you can see it. Go up right here and... I'm sick! That pilot's throwing up in there. But it turns into such a docile plane if you want it. I can put it in the lower right and just let it glide. And I mean, just the stall on it is nothing. So, I mean, the stall, it just kind of goes over real easy. Um, you know, if you can see the little guy, you're going to love it. Turn your rates for your ailerons down about half for your first couple flights, guys, until you get comfortable with it, and then go into your higher rate to get it to do the dumber stuff. Even with my rate cut in complete half. So this is half ailerons. Look how fast it is still. I mean, that's still respectable roll rate. Uh, we had 300 feet Whereas, here's the full aileron again. I'm sorry, Lori. I'll go out here. Full aileron again. It's, it, I mean, it really rolls crazy. I'm going to come right here in front of us real slow. Yeah, 
Whoops! Oh, I landed! Go again! <laughs> that was an unintentional landing. <laughs> but it's more exciting that way, right? The fun thing about these little toss and boss planes is they just bounce off the ground. You don't really hurt them. So low passes can be a ball. Whee! Well. Well. <laughs> oh, all right. I guess I should land it. I'm gonna make a turn here. Get her going slow. I've got it on the mid, the low right aileron setting, high elevator, so I can hold it off. We got the power off, just coming in at a glide. No gyro again. Look how stable the little guy is. Hold a little up, get it in ground effect, and just let her stop. Look at that. You can't ask for anything better for 109 bucks, guys. You just can't. Yeah, I think it's 120 a year, ten dollars a month, and then it was a 75 a year. Guys, the little lippish is a ball. It is stupid fast, and it's amazing how fast this plane can roll. Um, it, it definitely has one of the craziest roll rates of all the 64 millimeter planes. Um, being that it's a flying wing, uh, it has a really neat characteristics where, I mean, you can hold full up elevator and the plane will just come down on its own and it'll, it really won't ever drop a wing unless it's really windy outside. That's the only time you're going to have an issue flying this. Um, tame down your aileron rates on this for your first couple of flights. Like I said, I cut mine in half from the full rate elevator throw and uh, it's been working really well for me. As far as the elevator goes, I leave it 100% um, just because this is such an easy airplane. When you're flying slow, you use a lot of elevator and you can keep that nose up and it will glide forever. Um, just for fun one day, I flew this one and I, I did a flight where I was gliding it. I flew it for almost 12 minutes um, just by pulling that power back to where it's off and just gliding this airplane around. I mean, you can fly it forever. Um, flying it, hard i would set your timer to about three and a half to four minutes on a 1500 battery that's kind of the sweet spot i found for this one a lot of the other toss and boss planes fly on a 2200 but this one seems a little bit um, too nose heavy with that to me it'll fly on one don't get me wrong um, and i know some guys are doing almost 10 minute flights with that on there not conserving powers but the sweet spot to me was a 1500 for this airplane um, and it, the way it was flopping over itself, it'll only do that with the 15 in it. Whenever I do the 22 in it, I can't get it to do that crazy spin that y'all saw. Um, it's kind of fun. I, I've definitely pimped this one out. I papa dotted it. I'd show you up close, but like I said, I've flown mine a lot and I had an accident with it. So it's a little more crumpled than our other airplanes. Um, but uh, Anyway, like always, please like our videos. Please subscribe to our channel if you're enjoying our content. We've really been trying hard, especially this week with Toss and Boss Week. Make sure you check out our other videos if you haven't got a chance to see them. Um, we're going to be doing a plane giveaway on Sunday, 8 p.m. live on our uh, live show, as always. Come on by. We'd love to have you there. All right. Don't, oh, real quick, don't forget to check out our, our merch store. Look at that. Ah, Papa Dot's approved riveter here. All right, let's get out of here. See y'all later.